Yeoman reporting for Katie Chats here at the Blue Flame Collective's Global Village event in downtown Toronto with filmmaker Mark Teitler. Tell me how you found out about Global Village. Global Village. Well, last year I was a part of Blue Flame Collective. Uh, I shot a whopping six films just as a DP. Um, and this year I was invited back, so I, uh, I thought I would write something and uh, I directed it as well. So I'm um, pretty, pretty excited about it, about it for sure, yeah. What was the inspiration behind the making of your film, Say It Forward? Well, I was um, kind of limited with my writing. It was, it was meant to be about multiculturalism in Toronto. Um, so that, that kind of nailed down where I was going in the direction of it. <clears throat> um, and a group of friends, we got together, we, we chatted, we, we came up with some, some dialogue and a way the story was going to progress. And then um, one night I was uh, just thinking about it and I came up with a very, very inspiring ending, um, which I'm not going to say much about it, but it, uh, it definitely takes a, a little turn and turns into something special. So it's, uh, I, was, I'm, I was very proud of it. I hadn't uh, written and directed something in a while, so it was, it was great to see everything come together so well. Oh. Yeah. And... The title, Say It Forward, reminds me of the term, pay it forward. Okay. Are you a big fan of paying it forward? I would say I am, definitely, yeah, yeah. It's, it's kind of something along the lines of karma. It's the same, the same deal. So it's, um, it's definitely a play on words of uh, pay it forward. And uh, yeah, I'll just leave it there. How did everything go on set? Did production run smoothly? It did go smooth, considering the, the, the weekend we had to shoot it and the amount of locations and characters in it, it, uh, it went smooth. It was definitely a, just a simple skeleton crew. We went out and banged out the scenes really quick, but it went well, yeah, considering the amount of work. And what is the importance of Canadian film to you? I think it's very important, absolutely, just to, to, to show our identity in film. Uh, we tend to be, I think, very dramatic filmmakers. Um, and I just love being a part of that. We just, we, we aim to, we kind of struggle to have our identity being the, the little brother maybe to, to the U.S. and that huge market. So we definitely try to stand out <clears throat> and write uh, provocative or inspiring material. And I think, uh, I think that's something great and it's great to be a part of. And where's the best place to find out more information on you and your work online? You can check out uh, fedupfilms.net. And there you'll find a uh, sort of assortment of music videos and shorts. And uh, yeah, definitely check it out. Thank you so much. Congratulations and have a terrific time today. Thank you so much. Thank you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. I'm Katie Allman reporting for Katie Chats. You're at the Blue Flame Collective's Global Village event at the Big Picture Cinema in downtown Toronto.